Hello, today I'm here with a new video and if you don't know who I am, my name is Lisa. I'm a cruelty YouTuber that does a lot of makeup content. And today I am going to do a look with the Lethal well, 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 what? Velvet Dusk. And I did a video this week, maybe, maybe last week, where I talked about palettes for autumn, a little bit more grungy palettes and that I want to use more and this was one of the palettes. So this is one of their pre-made 12 pan palettes that looks like this and this is inspired by the 90s grunge vibe. I love that era and uh, yeah, I want to do a look with this. I have only used this once, I think I've used some of the colors Actually, I don't know, but <laughs> I'm going to use this today. And I really want to use this purple shade, this purple shimmer. And I put on one of my few not black sweaters. So I hope this that this green sweater will go good together with purple eye. So I think we just hop into this. I don't know if I should like tell you the plan before I start and then try to do what I'm planning or... It is what it is right now. So I actually think that I will start with this mustard shade in my crease and then deepen it down with this one. And on my lid, I'm not completely sure. I know that I want to use this, but I don't know if I want to take this blue or one of these. I would wish it was a really dark purple in this palette, but it's not. So we'll see, maybe I will, maybe I can swatch this. This is a really dark brown. Maybe that goes will go good together. So I will start with this mustard one and then go in with this one to tip it down and then these two on my lid. We'll see. And I, when it comes to lethal, I, these are some of the first like single shades that I've been really loving. Single shades has not, not been, why can't I speak? talk whatever why can't I make a sentence single shadows has never been one of my favorites like I like finished things I like to buy an eyeshadow palette because I just have like to have a palette in front of me but then lethal came and I love it because you can do your own palette on their website and then they come out with some of these like pre-made palettes and <laughs> for some reason I tend to use my singles more from Lethal than these pre-made palettes and I don't know why that is. But maybe it's just my thing. Maybe I found my thing when it comes to single shades. I don't know. I think this is a really nice shade. I think I used it in my first impression as well. So now I'm going in with this one. And I don't know why I don't use these more. And like this one, I was so excited when this came. Just because it feels like a color scheme that is really good. Like what I like. But I haven't used it that much. Okay, so far, so good. So now I will go in with these two on my lid and I think I'll try to have this just like a little bit on the outer corner because this shimmer looks amazing. And one girl that I follow on Instagram and also on YouTube. Yeah, I do. Um. I'm so bad sometimes with remembering name. Amelia? I can leave her down in the description. She did a look with this shimmer shade and I was like, that looks amazing. What is it? And then I understood it was something that I had in my collection that I haven't tried. Do that happen to you sometimes? Like you see someone do an amazing look with something and you're like, 
completely like blown away and then you read what they have used and you realize that you have that thing in your collection it has happened for me more than once and I feel like lethal is really good to making dark matte shades that maybe doesn't look so fun like in the pan but then you use it on your eyes and they look like freaking amazing so now I will dig in to the shimmer shade and I hope this will look good because I have been wanting to use this for so long ooh, ooh, ooh. it looks really really good maybe not the best match with my crease shade but it just have to work and I think I don't want to blend this in my crease that much I think I will go in with my crease shade instead and blend it like that and I have some crazy amount of fallouts here but I don't really care I do really like this combo I'm glad that I swatched that matte dark shade out and did it go with the blue one so we'll just go in with the dark matte and blend it together and then I will go in with the darker shade that I took in my crease tap my brush <laughs> tap my brush off tap my brush off and smudge it in here And now I'm starting to think about what I should take on my lips. I don't know. I think I have to go through my lipsticks and see what I will have. But I do really like this eye. I think that I will later on go in with maybe this in my inner corner. Or if I will take something else from Lethal. I think I have like a purple light like duochrome if I'm not I know that I have like a blue one and I think I should have a purple maybe I can take that or I take something else that I have in my collection I love it when something when I get like an idea for a look and then I'm trying to do it and it like gets better than I thought it would. I love it. I hate it when it is the other way around. <laughs> when I think about the look and I do the look and it turns out like shit. But this... I think it looks really really good. I do really like it. And I think it looks dark but like not too dark. And just fun ah, who am I so okay I will fix my base and maybe I have this ultimate palette from KVD maybe I should take this you can't see this can you see it if I hold it a little bit closer to you now can you see it if I have no oops I have things everywhere, but this is an ultraviolet amethyst thingy. Do you know what? <laughs> I will fix my base and we will see how it will look and what I do with the rest of my face and what I will do with my lips. Um, something is actually happening with my lip situation. I'm starting to like more toned down lips, but we will see. I will fix my base and then I come back or I will fix the rest of the look and then I come back I may be going to test out some lip colors maybe with you or I maybe find something that I'm like okay this I really want but I will fix my base and my under eyes and maybe my lips and then I come back with the finished look with the lethal velvet dusk and so far I love this look this is the finished look and I am in love with it. For my waterline I used Amethyst Hour just to 
I don't know, make it a little bit more brighter maybe. For my inner corner, I took Arsenic from Lethal. And on my lips, I took Mellow More from LH Cosmetics. And I, <laughs> I love everything about this look. So I'm so happy with it. I'm just going to try to get the palette. And now it's a cat playing with things she shouldn't play with. So I have used this shade and this shade in my crease and on my lower lash and these two on my lid and I I love this look. I think it looks really really good and it's dark but it's not too dark. And I'm so sorry for Ines but she can't like she wants to be with here but she like she wants a microphone and she takes she loves my makeup sponges, so she usually takes these. And I, I just can't have her here when she's acting like that. So now she's outside playing with something. But yeah, I do love this look. I think it goes good with my sweater as well. So yeah, and maybe I had this done before. I like, never know how to use polo shirt. But okay, I really hope you like this look. It has been so fun to play with this more and I want to play with this more. I don't know why, but it's just a palette that I haven't been using that much. Maybe it's time for me to start using it more. So yeah, I don't know what this is for kind of video, but as you know and as I have told you so many times, I really want to play with my collection. I have more and uh, this is just one way to do it and i know that you like that i'm trying to do that because a lot of you feel the same way and i need to stop talking about this in every video where i'm using something old in my collection but i really love to like this and i will use this palette more and also i will try to get through that little pile i have with things that i need to use more and i want to use more yeah, I really hope you liked this video and if you're not subscribing to my channel, please do so you don't miss any of my other videos, my new videos. <laughs> so I hope I'll see you in the next one. Bye!